subscribe to Infozone channel and press the bell icon for latest videos. Hey guys, welcome back. Now today in this video, I will show you value rent timeout error. Something unusual has happened and it is taking longer than expected to load error on your Windows PC. So for this guys, I will show you five methods for fix this issue. First one, simple and easy. Just right click on taskbar and select the task manager. Find here guys, Windows Explorer. So as you can see here, just right click on this folder, select the restart. And wait, now close this. And the second method, go to your restart menu, type here command prompt, right click, right click here, select the run as administrator. So now you need to type here several commands. First one, I click on big space forward slash release and hit enter on your keyboard. Next type the I click on big space forward slash slash DNS. Hit enter. Next, I click on click space forward slash renew. Press the enter. Now type the net sh space int space ip space reset and hit enter. Now type the net sh space winsoft space reset and press the enter. Last Type the command hfc space forward slash scan now and hit enter on your keyboard. You need to type here, guys, for complete this verification process. So, as you can see here, you wait for complete this 100%. And after, close your command prompt and restart your computer. Hopefully, it will fix your issue. And the third method to try to install your your older NYBI driver hopefully it will fix your issue and the fourth method you update your all drivers go to start menu type here device manager open this device manager control panel so now you update your all drivers like this right click on driver and select the update driver software Select the search automatically for update driver software. And another way to update the drivers like this. Right click on driver, select the update driver and select the second one option browse my computer for, for driver support. Select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. And select the driver, select the next and update your all drivers like this after you restart your computer. So hopefully guys it will fix your issue and still fixing the issue. Last option, if you are using Windows 7, you need to upgrade into Windows 10. So go to your browser. Open the browser, type here, download Windows 10 and hit enter. So open this first one link, download Windows 10 disk image. So first one update now and the second one download tools, select this, update now. Open this download file, select update now. Select the next. So you need to wait here for complete this updating process. So hopefully guys after the update it will fix your issue. So thanks for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe.